Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we will be looking at clothing items for the summer and winter for riding your motorbike. So if you have any questions or if you'd like me to do a particular video, uh, please let me know in the comments. So starting off with summer, because that is the big one and that's when most people ride. I like to use leggings, so just because they stretch. I the half mark, he actually has jeans, um, black jeans. He absolutely loves them, he actually works them most days. Um, so with these leggings, as I say, they're stretchy, uh, they've got hip padding in them and also knee padding and they're very comfortable to just keep walking around in as well if you go for a ride and you know you meet up with friends going shopping etc then they're great for everyday use so to go with that is the jacket that i've got so this is fantastic because it's very breathable um it just lets a lot of the air in but keeps you protected so you've got padding in the elbows and also the shoulders it is quite thin padding but I have been assured that it'll be okay if I come off uh, not that I want to test that but it is lovely for summer not so great for winter because it just feels that much colder when you're riding so you've got pockets on both sides and then you've got pockets inside as well you've actually got an air vent here as well moving on to winter uh, I have I have my leather jacket which is fantastic it's very thick very sturdy it's very heavy uh, this has got big padding in the elbows uh, I haven't got any back padding but I do have a pocket for the padding I do recommend having back padding but this jacket is a bit awkward for that padding and um, there are some really good brands out there but this is jacket that I've had for years um, I actually passed my license in this jacket so it's you know Got some sentimental meaning there and uh, so yeah this is what you need when riding in winter i would recommend thermals uh, something underneath your jeans or leggings just because it does get really cold another good idea is just having so medical gloves or um, cycling under gloves just put with your normal gloves so for the gloves i have for winter are these very thick full of leather uh, I do have summer gloves as well, which is just that little bit thinner. And again, that's the air, throw, air flow through. Uh, there are some padding that I wanted to talk about today. So, if you're like me, I'm quite short. Sure, um, where my knees are up on the motorbike, I'm always at sort of like a 90 degree angle. So these actually split across here a lot of the time. Uh, I've gone through three pairs of this kind of padding now, um, so it's starting to get you know a little bit expensive. You can see here starting to starting to come apart. So some knee protectors. These are I call them honeycomb just because the way that they are. You can cut them, um, but also it's just that sturdiness for when you're riding. So it should. Be okay it shouldn't split or anything i'm hoping that i don't have to keep buying protective knees these were the smallest i could buy but as i say you can cut them to size which uh, which i'll be doing today as i say if you have any questions or there's something i've not quite covered just let me know and i'll do another video thank you